The EU has agreed to hit Russia with a new package of sanctions, the 11th time it's done so since Ukraine was invaded in February last year. The aim is to make it possible to punish third countries that have been helping Moscow evade them. The aim of many existing sanctions is to close loopholes so that goods vital to President Putin's war effort don't get through. The EU's top official, Ursula von der Leyen, tweeted that they deal a further blow to Putin's war machine. Previous sanctions have targeted banks, companies and financial markets, even parts of the sensitive energy sector. And more than a thousand officials have had their assets frozen and been banned from entering the EU. But this is the first time that plans have been announced to target trade to Russia via other countries. Previous sanctions have been agreed on in just months, extremely quickly for the EU. But new measures are becoming increasingly hard to endorse as they inflict damage on the economic and political interests of some member states as well as the Kremlin.